Hey gamers, it's Grind This Game here, back with Oxygen Not Included. And I think I have my volume too high. Sorry, one sec. <laughs> so yeah, um, quite a few cycles have gone by since the last episode, as you'll see up here. And I didn't really do anything interesting off camera, except um, kind of more of the same. So down here in our oil biome. Oh, first off, all my Sixers died. I think it got too cold in here. Um, and they died. I was taking the long-haired slickers up to a different area once they were formed here, and I think they were forming because it was too warm, or too cold. There's one left here. I think it's the, the last remaining slickster. Uh, hopefully we'll get some on the portal, because I moved this area down here for when we get them back. It's kind of got a little bit, bit of a heating loop, which I used to heat up this area. So that I did off camera. Uh, what else did I do? I did a few more... Let's cancel that. I did a few more of these... Uh, oil wells. I had, I think, one before up here. This is the first one. And I've since added two more. So one there and then one here. And I made a blueprint out of it. As you can see, this one is pretty much close to identical to this one. So we got the blueprint for that now. Kind of looks like... Let's see here... Um, I forget which, which one I used to get through here. Up arrow? Nope, uh, right arrow? There we go, right arrow. So it's not that one. I got a bunch of blueprints in here. Maybe it didn't save, actually. Oh no, that's it right there. So I do have more oil wells on the map, which I'll be tapping into, but I'll probably do that off camera. I have a few issues though. Um, my petroleum is, has backed up completely. All these tanks are full now. And the tank at the top is also full. These four tanks here are full. So we got issues here where we got petroleum breaking in the line because it's freezing. That's kind of a big problem. I need to fix kind of right away. So. I think the really quickest fix will be to add a few more of these, which I'll eventually use. Oops, let's copy the pipe. We'll get those built first, that should help speed things up here. But I want to use jet suits. I haven't used jet suits in the past because they are laggy as can be. But I'm going to use them because I kind of want to be able to build up here without having to build ladders everywhere. It's a bit of a hassle because you have to... The dupes come up in exosuits and then they need to take them off somewhere. And then they need to uh, put the jet suits on. I was thinking of doing a little switch back here that will put the jet suits in. So we'll start digging this out. And then do like a column of jet suits along here and then force them to come around this way. So they'll take off their exosuits here, have a little area of peace and quiet where they can breathe, hopefully. And then they'll get on their jet suits and come up to the top so they can fly around and then we'll block them from going through the store. And I'm not used to talking, so my voice is like super hoarse. It's been a while since I recorded. So we'll need to do some exosuit docks here first. Let's do that first. Okay, stations. I won't need a whole lot of them, but atmosphere checkpoint. Let's leave room for five. So, oh, lag. Massive save lag. One, two, three, four, five, and a bit. Is this what I want? Let me think about this. I haven't built something like this before. Um, that's to actually put them on. I actually want the reverse kind of. Will this work? I don't think this will work. Actually, this will work. Yeah, we'll put the check suit point here. And then a few docks so they can take their suit off and then they'll be in the free zone. 
and then we'll put the petroleum ones up here. So let's get all that set up here. Atmosphere dock. We'll put five. I think five should do it. Let's should we use steel? No, but gold's actually lead is probably. I mean iron is probably fine. Let's do four. Four is probably enough for now. And then on the other end, we'll get a station ready here. Let's see, jet suit checkpoint. We'll leave room for a bit more. Oh, this is huge. This is four big. Uh, we'll leave. We'll put it over here so we have a bit more room. This might actually be up in space here. Space exposure. That's no good. Uh, Devin. <laughs> Took your suit off and you have no way to put it back on. So now you're stuck here. Oh boy. Let's disable that so he can get out. Is he going to be able to put his suit back on? Probably not. I should have built the suits first and the checkpoint after. <laughs> But let's get some oxygen going over here. Into this. Maybe we can split off here, actually. And we need power. And I have no power up here. So we might have to do another power line transformer setup. Hmm. Okay, we can build background tiles in here, so let's get this ready here for the space exposure. We'll just get those ready. Uh, utility. Drywall should be fine. Guess I'll use Mavic Rock here. Don't need it to be too much. We're going to be venting oxygen here while we do this. Probably not the best, but... And I think I'm going to need to build a ladder here so they can reach up to the top. Since I have the backbone, backbone power line over here, I think what I'll do is sneak in through here. And kind of get ready on this end as well. So we'll get the power hooked up. We also need to start building the suits. Actually, these pipes are all breaking. Did I get that hooked up? We gotta, we gotta stop making petroleum, but that's gonna cause another problem. This is like a cascading set of problems. Uh, the other problem is gonna be the oil. The oil will back up. No, that's okay here, because it can splash down there. And up here, it's gonna overflow and go down here, which is fine. And this one will end up over here. That's fine. So. Kind of not the worst problem to have. We just gotta start burning that petroleum. And we also gotta start burning the natural gas. Actually, that's fine now. Let's bring this down a bit. So that we start burning petroleum. And that didn't do anything. Let's bring it way down. Even more? Something's wrong here. What have I done wrong? Low threshold nine. What's going on here? That's hooked up, right? Well, it never got that low. Actually, I wanted the reverse. <laughs> but we're batteries all full anyway, so. That's not going to help. But we can probably stop making petroleum, so let's turn these off. For now. Otherwise, we're just going to be plugging up, the, plugging up the lines. The other thing I need is some petroleum that's accessible for them to uh, use. So we'll put that in a tank somewhere. I want it close to this thing, because we're going to make jet suits. We're going to make five... Five of those, but we need some petroleum. And we got petroleum on the ground here. 
Let's try to stick that in a little pool right here. Maybe just like this. Actually, we can put it up like this. And hopefully it'll get stuck. Put a little access ladder here. I could have put it over here, but I want to leave that alone. Oh, look at that. Uh, I swear, they, they want to just get stuck. Hopefully we can get Snappy out of there. Snappily. Leaf. Okay. Now we gotta put the petroleum in. So we'll just do a vent, right, like this. But not so emergency. Let's bring that back down to a more normal, sane level. Actually, something else is... Okay, we're good. So that should just put a little bit of petroleum in there. And then they can suck it up and bring it up over here and make those... Uh, jet suits. I've also been running lots of rocket missions and doing lots of uh, telescoping. I'm going to keep an eye on this until they finish it. There we go. Okay, there we go. So petroleum's available. And they should be able to get it out of here without moving too far. Wow, they're really busy. What are they doing? What are they working on? What are they grabbing here? Little bits of... Little bits of uh, carbon dioxide, which they couldn't really deal with. Oh, this space is actually quite a mess. Um, we've got liquids everywhere. What a mess. We'll, we'll slowly clean things up. Things melting and freezing all over the place. Okay, let's get that telescope busy. <clears throat> uh, reduce visibility, that's okay, I think, maybe. See, I've scanned all these things. Oh, this one looks really cool. The helium giant. Very cool. Very cool indeed. We've got uh, only two left to scan. And this uh, steam rocket, we're filling it again. Good. This might be our, our, one of our last steam rocket missions. We gotta get onto the petroleum rocket. Okay, so power line, that's what we need. Let's do this here, just to make it steel, sure. We gotta fill this in and oxygenate it. Let's seal her up. Back rock. And we'll just do background tile in here. And we need a door here. How are we going to do this? We're going to do a switch back. We'll probably seal this in. Once they're done all the background tile, we'll lock this up. Maybe with a door. Actually, we won't be able to put a door in there. We actually need, um, let's see here. We're gonna use a tile here. Heavy what? Heavy what? Joint plate. I think I did that all as petrol uh, as a uh, petroleum <laughs> priority. I almost said priority instead of petroleum. Petroleum instead of priority. Priority nine is a little bit heavy duty for what we need. Let's bring that down a bit. So, are we filling these up? We're filling these up. We have no suits here. We don't actually want suits here, because they're gonna drop them off. They're gonna get in the other suits, and then they're gonna be on their way. Jet suit docks. I forgot how big these were. Let's leave some room here, and put them here. 
We'll start with just two. We can always expand. Actually, we should be building these backwards. You know what? I'm just gonna build them all. I have five jets, it's perfect. Okay, we'll build all five, I guess. And we gotta seal this up here. Do I want copper? Should be fine for power line. And then another power line here. We'll break the seal after. Lead? Uh, I think we'll be okay. Oh, we're still venting air here. Oops. Missed a couple. And that power line actually has to go all the way to these suits as well. We might need another algae diffuser oxygen thingy here. And maybe even another pump. I'm getting oxalate ready here. Because, actually, what's the temperature in here? Minus 110. I think I might actually be just... Is this even doing anything? I think it's just falling on the ground and emitting, yeah, 429 kilograms and fading fast. I was going to store it over here. So consumable ore. Uh, there you are. Oxalite, priority nine. Well, eight's fine. And we should probably just convey it over there to save dupes from running back and forth. Usually I put like a little trough beside this thing. Maybe we'll move it actually, because right now it's in kind of a bad spot. Let's move it. Because they're going to be running back and forth, back and forth. Yeah, let's put it over here in the warmth area. Steel plastic, yeah. That'll work. Then we can actually just grab it, toss it in the water. And take this one offline. Okay going on in here? Chlorine, solid chlorine. Okay, I think we're ready to break the seal here. I think we can do that. That's blocked in. Uh, we don't have a exosuit dock here. That's disabled. I think we'll be able to get in here, no problem. Uh, we can launch our rocket, so let's get that underway. Just been going to the same place over and over. Really exciting. Gotta take this out. I'm kinda trapped here. What I might have to do is block off a good portion of the map so that the the pathfinding is not so bad. Might just block it off here. So they don't have to come over here and they're just allowed in this area. We'll see what the leg's like. Okay, we're gonna need oxygen along here as well. And where should we let them out? I think we'll just have a little switch back here. Checkpoint, and then maybe a ladder over here so they can get out and get to the top. We don't want any loops though, so we don't want them coming out here and then going back down here. Or we'll have a bit of a nightmare. And these things give off CO2, actually. Forgot about that. Let's leave some room here. So we got... Room for the... One more. Actually, let's build one more. Then the checkpoint. Then some ladders. We won't poke through just yet. And then we'll put an airlock at the top here.
and didn't get that hooked up yet. I think this will work. Pretty sure it'll work. Probably should have built a tile here instead of a background tile. So they need a little area they can breathe before they switch suits. And I think we can safely hook up that door as well. How's our meteor laser doing? Kill count, 12, 13. We got our cooling loop. It's actually getting really cold in there. Oh, I gotta hook up to the trollium. That's kind of high priority. Let's do that. Let's go on along here into those. And maybe we'll start switching the rocket out. Because, uh, kind of done with the steam. But maybe we'll wait till our exosuit guys can just build all this for us, because then they can fly around. Which should be fun to watch. Might need another deoxidizer here. Chuck one of those over here, maybe. Let's get those suits delivered. I think we can do that. These things are pretty funny looking. I don't usually use them because they're so laggy, but we're going to use them just for the fun of it. Now, these suits are going to consume all my oxygen, which is kind of a drag. Uh, but we do got to make sure there's oxygen here. I guess with the, maybe we'll put another pump in and feed these ones separately. That's what I'll do. Then I need another filter. Mm -hmm. You know what, I'll just split it. We'll split it off here. That way we'll at least start filling these up. And that should help things with that. Algae, how much algae do we have? We got some big algae blocks out there we haven't used yet, so. Organic, where are you? Five tons. Actually, we don't have that much. <laughs> Being a YouTuber and losing your voice, not a, not a great combo. Okay, let's see. That's good. Actually, what the heck am I doing here? I should be coming out of the filtered end. Uh, but we're kind of safely, we only have oxygen in here. We're going to have CO2 in here the minute these things start going, potentially. So I better fix this up here. The filtered output should actually be feeding everything here. Not, let's cut that. Should be over here and then like this. Clean this up a bit. And go like that. Split off like that. That should work. No checkpoint. Can we safely put the checkpoint in? I think so. They're not going to go anywhere. They can't really go anywhere, so let's do that. Jetsu checkpoint. Will that actually not fit there because of my ladder? Oh no, there we go. Let's use steel.
I'm glad they put that diagram on there, though. It does clear things up. New printables. I haven't looked at this in a while. Uh, joy seat? Sure. Do that. I think maybe we could, uh, where's our rocket? Getting close. Nicely oxygenated, oxygenated in there. Hey, oh no. Did he, oh, he took off his suit. So he took off his exosuit there. Hmm. <laughs> we gotta turn this on right away. But not with a yellow alert. And let's block this door from access. And hope this works. They should, oh, he's got no suit. Let's put him back in the base. Actually, he's probably going back to base. Oh, lag. Where did all this lag come from? I just got a massive lag spike. Oh, it's probably the jet suits. <laughs> it's probably the jet suits. Let's slow things down here. Make sure this works. Take off your suit. Get in another suit. There you go. Maybe. Oh, there you go, actually. You're you're out. <laughs> what are you gonna do? Just fly around? Oh now they can actually <laughs> Now they can grab stuff. Check out the pathfinding here though. Uh show navigation. Uh this is all the possible places they can go in their jet suits. Joy. Uh we're gonna have to wall them off, I think. That's where the lag came from. Oh my gosh. Well, at least they're exploring. Where are they going? What are they doing? Bright and cheerful. Wh what is he doing? Oh, he's getting shells. Okay, we want them to be able to walk over there. Oh, the lag is horrendous. Uh, this is why I didn't want to use them, but we're gonna use them. Let's start digging all this crap away. Now that they can go everywhere. That'll start using up that petroleum, that's for sure. Unreachable food. Liam, why can you not reach your food? You should be able to come back here. No oxygen. Have I messed this up? You should be able to come back here. Nope. Why not? Why can't you come back, Liam? Are we gonna have dead dupes here? Better not. Better not have any dead dupes. Okay, um, hmm. Let's move everyone back here. I can go to here. The door is open. Is it just the game being dumb? Now they're fine. Atmos suits here. Oh, because they're not hung up, they can't get back. Well, this is kind of dumb. Hmm. Hmm. This is what I was afraid of. We'll disable the checkpoint, but that's no good. Um, okay, they're back out, but that's kind of not what I wanted. Because they're going to come up here, drop some suits, and leave them here for ever. I've seen this done properly, I just should have uh, looked it up first. The alternative is to just get rid of the suits at the top and the bottom. Get rid of the suits here, get rid of the suits here, and just let them only fly around. There's not really any dangerous spots for them to go anymore, so maybe I'll do that. Actually, here they could fry themselves. Hmm.
Not quite what I wanted. And definitely not enough oxygen going into those suits. We need more oxygen. Do I want to do another filter? Probably not. We could just have another pump over here. And chuck that in here. Two pumps of one filter. I think that's good. What can this do? It's been a while. Doesn't tell you what their capacity is. Thought it did. Maybe I'll just get rid of the fil the get rid of these and then force them to fly everywhere. And try to keep them out of here. 70 degrees. Let's get that telescope going. Now they're just forgetting their exosuits completely. <laughs> Considering redoing this whole thing. I thought this would be fine. But it's not working. Not working as intended. Uh, okay, let's forget this. And... Actually, what will happen if they come up in exosuits in here? Will they switch suits? I don't even know. I think they'll just, yeah, they'll just dump their exosuit on the ground and leave it there. Which is also not what I want. Oh boy. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe we'll disable all these. And just let them run around like they used to. Because I don't think it's that dangerous out there. And then, yeah, they should be relatively okay. Oh, I probably just deconstructed a bunch of stuff I didn't want. Let's disable these for now. Actually, let's just destroy them. After all the hard work of building them. that's going to work. Maybe that's how I should have done it from the beginning. I have the risk of them getting burnt over here, but that's probably okay. Okay, the rocket's back. I think I'm going to start deconstructing this and building the petroleum one. But yeah, they should be able to fly there. I think I can probably get rid of this silo, but maybe not. Uh, let's do... Okay, let's get the bottom off first. Oops, let's make sure we do that correctly. Deconstruct that. Okay, we're taking the steam engine off. Are we gonna have room for all our tanks and stuff? I think so. Still wanna use 
five research modules, maybe. I usually put the tanks on the bottom. And maybe we'll do that. Uh, let's, uh, hmm. Planning would go a long way. I do plan these episodes. I have a rough idea of what I want to do, but then the actual details uh, don't always work out. <laughs> if I let this dupe out, are they still gonna? Are they gonna bring their suit with them? Probably not. Okay, but let's get the rocket, new rocket petroleum engine on. Oh, we're still blowing steam out into the ether there. <laughs> But uh, I think we can safely just disassemble all this stuff. We don't need the steam anymore. At least I'm pretty sure. Let's make sure we got all the research for petroleum rockets. I think we do. Let's double check that. We got the liquid fuel tank, solid oxidator tank. Yeah, we're good. I think we got everything we need. Yep. Safe to open this up and just start ripping this apart. We're not going to do any more refining here. Oh, they have, they're able to get in here. I guess that's okay. So if we do five research modules and then Tank, 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 tank. Oh, I don't know if it's going to fit. Oh, overheating. We're overheating our crap here. Oh, joy. All the steam is coming out. <laughs> um, hmm. It should just dissipate. And I think we'll be okay. Maybe should I use, maybe I should have pumped the steam out into a up here first, instead of just cracking it all open. Oh, the lag. Okay, let me see if I can fit this. Tank, tank, tank. Uh, is this gonna fit? We could, could just go with four research modules instead of five. I think I actually will. Because we don't need to maximize the research on every single rocket run, to be honest. Yeah, let's just go with four. And we'll do, let's see, oh, wait a minute. Oh crap, you have no, oh, you're stuck. You are stuck. You should be able to come down here though. And nope, that's trapped. Oh boy, you're really trapped. Um, <laughs> um, okay, let's do an emergency ladder here. I forgot about Matt's suit. Actually, if we turn this on, we should be able to get across down there. Oh, he can't get back out though. Actually, he should be able to get out here. Come on, Matt. You are safe. Okay, good. Whew. He's a little bit worried there. Oh, these are going to stay hot, aren't they? Hmm. Okay, since this has to be loaded, let's do this tank here. Solid oxidizer tank right there. Got to reset my priorities. 
And I wish you could just build all the tanks at once, but you can't. So we're going to have to just do one at a time here. Let's see what we got here. Uh, pufflets. Not really interested in pufflets. As cute as they're. We're going to be repairing these forever. I think we just need to deconstruct them. The petroleum should be in bottles and not leak out on the ground and disappear into, that, into the vacuum. Yeah, it's on the ground here. That's good. Petroleum. Perfect. That's kind of a hacky way to get stuff bottled up really quickly. Is to put it in a tank and then deconstruct the tank. Okay, next rocket stage here. We've got the liquid fuel tank. They can fly anywhere. Now ladders are still good because then they won't waste their petroleum flying around. And I think we can safely put a few more of these on here since we're going with going with no atmosuit docks here. And we're pumping oxygen into this room, no longer needed really. And this is full of hot crude oil, which is cooling down, so we'll just let that do its thing. But should I be pumping oxygen in there anymore? Probably not. Okay, one more stage to go here. Let's get the pipe going too. Petroleum pipe. Uh, that's gonna go along here. Should we rebu rebuild our tanks? Uh, maybe out of steel this time. And then, this doesn't need to be... Uh, it should be insulated, because if it's not... Hot rocket exhaust could get on it, potentially. Maybe. Uh, it's okay if it gets really hot though, actually, because it's petroleum. We'll use Mavic Rock if we got it around. Mm, not allowed. We'll use Ignis. And this is heading up this way. Okay, and then one more. Then the top, and then I think we're good. And this actually has to be in a loop. Potentially. Does it need to be in a loop? No. We're good. Oh, big, big, big lag. And we might not need, need a uh, thing to get in here. Gantry. We might just be able to get them to fly in. But let's go build some more some suits here. We want uh, maybe five more of these. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, disaster, Bill. Oh my god. This used to work so that it would overpressurize and no more petroleum would come out, but that is not working for me. This has always worked for me in the past. I think something has changed in the game. Uh, we need to stop that immediately. Oh my gosh. 
What a mess. What a mess I've made. Oh my gosh. No. No. <laughs> what a disaster, Bill. Oh boy, is that going in the water supply? Not just yet. We'll have to get that out of there. Oh man. The messes I make. The messes I make. But honestly, this has worked for me in the past 100% of the time. It overpressurizes and it just stays at that level. Oh yeah, I think this might be new. I got a some Paku on the printer and I had to let them fall down here into this little hole. Okay, they're cleaning up my mess. Uh, probably want to put a pump here to get that petroleum out of there. Where else has it fallen? Oh my gosh. It's in the water supply down here. Oh my gosh. Oh, and the lag is so bad. I regret making jet suits, folks. I regret it. <laughs> and we probably don't need to fill all these tanks to go where we're going first. So let's bring these down. I don't have all the rocket calculations in my head, so I can't remember how much, how much we need for each thing here. Uh, we'll see where we can go, though. Okay, I think I need to prevent them from getting everywhere. Reduce the lag a little bit. I was thinking of doing some solar around here. So maybe we can do a a blockade here. Is the laser going to reach all the way over there? Uh, nope. Hmm. Maybe we'll do this. Oh, the lag. I'm sorry. Sorry, game. Oh my gosh, nine frames per second. Disaster bill. Oh. Yeah, we're going to build a wall here to prevent them from flying over here. And hopefully that helps things a little bit. Why am I building a ladder? <laughs> I guess the ladder will help them a little bit. Oh, I... <laughs> we don't need a ladder. They can fly. Sometimes I forget. Okay. Uh, don't really need that. Or that. All I really need is some tiles here. To block this area off. Okay. That is going to get destroyed by meteorites. Um... Maybe we will cap it off a little bit. Or maybe do bunker tile for part of this. Or put another laser in. We could do another laser. Over here maybe? Do have some petroleum here somewhere. 
right under this tile here. Some of the stuff gets through though. It's a bit of a problem. Okay, this is another disaster. Uh, let's cap this off. For now. Try to help preserve this wall a little bit. Oh, sunstroke. Could have been probably using a lot of petroleum here. It's like I'm in the cycle 5000. That's what it feels like. This probably won't help the lag too much, but maybe a bit. As long as we don't trap them in there. <laughs> okay. Back to rocket stuff. Uh, we need the top of the rocket. Command capsule. We'll put a storage tank on here later. If we have room. Oh god. Uh, but we're not going to be collect- actually, should we collect stuff? Let's see if we can... I think we'll be able to. Cargo bay. Oh, I didn't leave enough room for any of this. Cargo bay and then the top? Oh god. Will it fit? Will it fit? Uh, will we have to redo the whole rocket here? No, we could always swap it out down here. I think it'll fit? It's going to be tight. It might not fit. Will it allow it? Will it allow it? Uh, I don't know. We'll find out. Find out very soon. What do we got on the printer? More rust. This looks kind of lopsided. How's our petroleum supply down here? Uh, I turned these off, so I should probably turn them back on. Oh my gosh, we drained it. How did we drain it all? What the heck? We used it all up? All on jet suits, maybe? Or the rocket? Jeez. Oil is dropping down here. And there. Well, at least we got it being made again. That should help the blockade of oil <laughs> spilling everywhere. Okay, how do we do up here? Still being built. I have a feeling this is not going to fit. Will it fit? No! <laughs> okay, we're going back one. We're going to swap it out here.
Okay, we'll put cargo down here. And I gotta deconstruct this mess here that I made. Low priority cleanup. That can all go. So we should plumber this oil out. Pretty hot in there. <laughs> oh, and the pressure. Nine kilograms. Oh, I think it's because the vent the vent was underwater here. Let's safely open this. Actually, let's just remove this door. Actually, no, we'll leave it. Uh, let's restrict access in here and we'll make them fly in from the top here I shall leave it for now <laughs> okay so we move that down let's put the top of the rocket back on or on for, for once I should say I never hooked up my oxygen, ox, oxalizer, oxidizer, oxalate, oxalite. Yes, I can talk. Okay, that has to go all here. We want to be able to drop this on the ground, so... Conveyor sweeper. Iron should be fine. Somewhere along here. Stick it there, and then it should be able to reach the oxalate and stick it in... We need to load it. Or can we just let it? Yeah, we'll have to load it here. Here, loader. And then we'll just dump it in the water. That should work. Gotta keep an eye on the algae here. Let's get them busy doing some algae excavation here. Might as well get it all. And more here. We have a lot of food, 2.5 million extra calories. Probably have it rotting away as well because we don't have a lot of fridges. Okay, Matt, can you get in the rocket? Hopefully you'll be able to fly up there somehow. Maybe. If not, we'll need a gantry. Delivering tiny little bits of oxalate. That should grab that and stick it in there. And it's doing that, kind of, but not very quickly. It's it's doing what I want though, okay.
I'm not sure Matt's going to be able to fly in here, so we might need a gantry. Never mind. He made it. <laughs> okay, let's see far, how far we can go with the amount of fuel we got right now. Probably don't need 2700 for the places we're going here. Let's see. Too far. Okay. Hmm. I think we need more petroleum. We'll just... I don't know, we'll go halfway here. Oh, they're delivering micrograms of... That's a waste of their time. Set that priority one for now. Hopefully that'll slow them down a bit. Yeah, we got two full tanks. We still can go nowhere. Hmm. Hmm. I think it's just a lack of oxalate that's the issue. But we might need more fuel. <laughs> we'll just load up the full rocket here. As full as we can fill it. And see how far we can go. Actually, a full, full rocket will be like kind of overkill. So let's bring that back down. Oh. But we can go here. That's not very exciting. We want to go someplace new. We don't need this oxalate container anymore. It's fine if it just sits in the water. And really, we should build a gantry so they don't have to fly in, they can just walk in. We're up to 900. Can we get anywhere closer, farther? Oh yeah, now we can. Now we can go here. Okay. Okay. Let's uh, kind of turn this down to 900. And I think we could safely probably just fill two tanks, but let's just uh, let's go to this one first here. And hopefully, I got my gantries in out of the way. Yeah. And. It's gonna get pretty hot in here. 28, 2900 degrees. Something's gonna melt. <laughs> Almost certainly. Yeah, that's gonna melt. <laughs> yep. Well, at least we got our petroleum rocket away. A disorganized mess as usual. That's how we roll here. Just for kicks, I want to dig this out. And let's get this hooked up. We need power all the way over there. Um, let's just do this. Copper ore? Uh, sure. Maybe we should just get some solar going here. I did make some glass off camera. Now you're supposed to layer these things in kind of like a pyramid, so we'll try to do that. Something like this where they overlap. I'm not sure exactly what the the deal is. Um, what's the halfway mark? How long are these things? We'll go with something like this and hope that 
works. Well, I can you build them like that? I usually just build a straight line, but if you do a pyramid, you get more sunlight hitting them. And that has to go into the main power grid, which we conveniently have here. Okay, let's cancel this. It's not, not as important as building the this. And this will make a one, because we don't care too much about that. And you guys can still get out. Uh, let's fix that. Let's make this a one-way door. Feels like they're going in slow motion, like little bees. Well, we'll get some extra power there, that's for sure. Oh, I know where all my petroleum went now. I was asking the question earlier. Um, it's all in this giant tank now. I think all my fish died. Or the cycle of life continued there, I'm not quite sure. Got some massive cleanup to do. I did add to the sleetweed farm a little bit. There's a little bit going on here. It's kind of warming up this area right now. Not too worried about that project though, because we're we've got too much food. I have to get the petroleum out of the water tank. I'll probably do that off camera. We'll we'll put another pump right here. Filter out the petroleum. Conveniently it's kind of right in this little section here, so we might be okay for a while. Could try to put a tile here and push it over. Best to draw it out though and filter it out. I could move my pump over to this end. That's probably safer. For now, yeah, let's do that. We're gonna put this over here at the edge. Get rid of this pump for now. Whoa. Yeah, do that. Take this pump out. and then try to pump out just this section here. What did I just do here? God. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, that was not too bad. <laughs> That's going to go the wrong place. Uh, will it get that bead? No. Um, okay, we're going to have to do some quick plier work here. Oh yeah, I put the pinch of pepper nuts in off camera as well. Just uh, don't really need them, but figured I'd build them since we had a warm area there, and we were getting we were backing up on polluted water, so seemed like a good thing to do. I have to do some massive cleanup. Um, salt water. Why does this pipe look so weird?
Brine plus salt water. Okay. It's getting a mix. Which is okay. Oh yeah, this was my convoluted cooling system here. Which is not going to work very well. I'm going to have to fix this up. Because it can potentially run out of water up here, which is being used to generate steam. <laughs> anyway, lots of failed experiments. Are there any petroleum coming up the top here? Maybe we can... I'll oh, we'll just leave that alone. Okay, let's go back up top side for now. How are we doing up here? We are out of oxygen completely. Did I run out of algae? Probably not. Probably impossible. We ran out of algae? Okay. <laughs> I thought I dug a bunch extra. Okay. We'll dig it out. Take those feet off, Liam. Okay, we got oxygen back online <laughs> temporarily. How's our rocket? Uh, 41%. Solar, we got solar coming in. Looking good. Let's put one above here. I think we want something like that. Maybe make a pyramid kind of formation here. Gonna be able to get all the way back down? Probably not. Maybe we need to chop that off here. I'm not quite sure where the overlap is supposed to be. This was uh, maybe not quite right. Something like that? Kind of looks neat. We're going to get a lot of power out of these. Which is probably good because we're burning through a bunch of petroleum. Okay, what are these guys doing with the... Where are they taking this oxalate? Okay, it's all on the ground. That's good. Okay, they're not picking it up. I thought they were running in there picking up little tiny bits, but they're not. Oh, that's interesting. <laughs> that doesn't belong there. Okay, I still, I'm allowing them over here. 
Uh, let's make sure they can only get back in. Oh, the the frame rate just went crazy faster, uh, but not they can sneak through here. Okay. Didn't think they could do that. So we'll put a tile there. We'll see if we get some extra frames. We're at 40 right now, even though it feels kind of sluggish. Okay, now we got 20 frames. Uh, four frames. Uh, I think it really depends on where they are and what they're doing. What? They're still getting out. <laughs> what? I can't build here. They can fly over top. How do I block them? There's no way. That's a bug. Jeez. How do we trap them? Can we build a door here instead? That's not gonna help actually. Jeez Louise, how do we trap them? I guess we could build the shield all the way along the top. That's the only kind of way to do it. We're gonna pause to do this. And even that's not working. Can't leave any holes. <laughs> Zoom in all the way. Plug. Oh. Plug the holes. <laughs> oh, we got some massive lag. Okay, what priority did I do that? Nine, of course. Okay, that should plug the hole. They're gonna be able to fly in this little area. <laughs> but not in here. Oh, I think I'm gonna wrap it up here, folks, because the lag is... Horrendous. I need to get the lag under control. Maybe we toss the jet suit idea. It was a fun experiment, but the game has to be playable as well. Sometimes it's fine, we're at 40 frames and then it drops to 4. Depending on where they're going. Okay. Well, I hope you enjoyed this episode. We did get some new stuff in. We got some solar in. We got the petroleum rocket set up. We made a mess. I'll do some cleanup for sure because this is just, there's just crap everywhere and there's liquids mixed and it's probably driving a bunch of you mad. It's driving me mad. So, slow things back down and we'll wrap it up here. Oh yeah, one thing I wanted to mention is that our shovels, I've been feeding them 10 kilograms of dirt here. It says hatches, but just dirt. Little tiny driplets of dirt, and that's allowing them to multiply. So now we have... How many do we have in here? Where's my going to drop off? Right here, behind all the... Oh, there's so many. There's 32 in here. So we're getting, like, crazy amounts of meat from this. They're multiplying because they're, a few of them are getting fed. We have lots of dirt, 600 tons, so... We'll just continue to multiply them up here. Because eventually we'll run out of igneous rock. Actually, we're running out really fast here. We're down to 680. We were at 1,000. Once we run out of igneous rock, all these stone hatches are done for. We could switch to sedimentary rock for a while, but uh, not a whole lot of that. Now, the reason I did smooth hatches here is because I didn't have the achievement for the, There's an achievement for these guys, uh, which we can take a look at here real quick. So the game doesn't crash. Uh, it is down the hatch. Ref refine, produce 10 tons of refined metal. I had never done that one before. So, 
uh, that one's done. But we're going to wrap it up here. Hope you enjoyed this episode. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you all next time.